program. And some have said that this was a hit from Iran, you know, taking him out. I don't think it was, but uh, I, I, nah, one of the things... The dumpster aspect of it sort of, you know, eliminates the Iran thing, I think. Yeah, it, it was definitely a message, and uh, it looked like he was drugged uh, beforehand. And it, he was gang-stalked. Yes. And that was another thing we've talked about was that gang stock would become it's the big. means of social control. You know, they've been practicing it for years, but now what we said was good, it was going to be, uh, you know, everybody is going to probably have some experience with it. So you, you should get it's some horrible. knowledge about what it is and recognizing it when it's happening. And I, I know someone personally right now that I'm convinced is, is has this going on, and uh, there, there's going to be a, a snitch in every neighborhood. Uh, the, the, this funding, all this trillions of dollars that have disappeared, uh, like I said, a, a great portion of that has, has been specifically designated to build up the spy infrastructure, to, to set up the, the gang stalking infrastructure uh, on a on a mass scale, so that they've got lots and lots of money to hire lots and lots of thugs and the operatives to to keep everybody in line because it, the resistance, the the reactionary resistance to what's coming down the pike and what's happening now, yeah, you know, people are going to start go, going crazy, going to start being angry and <laughs> wanting to resist and fight back. Uh-oh. And there's that there's going to be familiar. someone you know next door that's going to be. Uh, reporting you, <laughs> your every move. I mean, it's it's a it's a yucky, creepy time. And we, like I said, we're going to experience what it was like to live in the Soviet Union at the at the worst of its uh, at the worst of its worst. When well, behind, you could not trust anyone. Uh, you know, this I just feel are the forces of darkness or the forces of tyranny. They're dictatorships. We can call it communism if you like, but I mean, behind that, it's it's the same people that have ruined all these different countries and p- tried to put people in human bondage forever. It's Pharaoh, you know, it's, yeah. it's the KGB. It's, uh, you know, it's, uh, you know, I understand. Yeah, they, 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 communism they, they found was the, that was like the, the distillation of all of the uh, previous ages attempts at tyranny. And right. they found that by, by devising a, a social theory that could replace religion, and give people a sense of uh, being uh, altruistic by fighting for the common good and the common man. They they came up with a a methodology yeah. in communism that is a, is just a, a supreme battering ram in terms of wrecking any targeted civilization, any and especially a Western. Oh Judeo- no, they're going to take take it all down. I mean, here they've got the backing of uh, the whole, like, Hispanic culture is behind, uh, is, is, is with that, you know, because it yeah, means, yeah. and, you know, you also have, uh, so you have minorities in general who think it's, like, mm-hmm. for the greater good. and Right, it, and it's going to be payback, payback for, for their oppression, and this stuff's been, uh, right. and they've, they've, been, been, they've been stroking this for decades, and now it's, it's coming to its fruition. Yeah, kill all white people that you find in the Southwest, kill them all. Mm-hmm. And, uh, you know, reclaim it for uh, the Hispanics. Oh, I'm sorry, but the Indians were here first. Nope. Uh, sorry, the Hispanics. We're just going to be uh, we're going to be hypocrites here. We'll have it. It was Hispanics and Indians were living, as Obama said, we're living peacefully here before the white man came. Well, and, and if, if they were <laughs> serious, if, if they were. Well, yeah, that's a joke. <laughs> 